We're here at the SIA Snow Show 2012, baby. Boardinsiders.com, your snowboard resource. Hey guys, how's it going? AJ here with K2 Snowboards, right at SIA, and enjoying the beautiful day talking about new product, WWW Worldwide Weapon. It's a tried and true board in K2's line. It's been around for over 10 years. Originally designed and helped created by Travis Parker, who is again back with the team. Board has stand, stood as a staple board in our line for the longest time. A lot of riders ride it, has a lot of longevity to it. The real key to that longevity is the top sheet. We actually do a swap top die cut P-Tex top sheet. Same exact material that's on the base, running it right on the top. And the key to that is sandwiching it between two P-Tex materials, adds a little extra dampening, so a great feel while it's riding, as well as a durability factor. This thing can be beat up, slammed around, kind of taken to that next level, and it really holds up. Just think about it. You hit a rock and you gouge out your base, what do you do? You fill it with P-Tex. Scrape up your base on the top, ding it on a rail, fill it with P-Tex. That's the, kind of the idea and the point behind it. Another real key that has separated this board for a long, long time and has been imitated by some others is our extended effective edge. And what we do is we actually blunt our nose and tail, taking the effective edge and extending it by five centimeters. We call this jib tip. Really the whole point behind it is if you typically ride at 159, you can actually get down to this 154 and really enjoy your ride. Still have that same strong platform that you're used to, but less board for you to throw around and have to work on. This board's really been designed for rail kids, you know, to get out there, have less stuff for them to throw around and really be able for them to ride. But the, kind of the key to it is, is with that extended effective edge, if you're a bigger guy, a more aggressive guy, and you used to ride really aggressively, ride it at your normal length. If you used to ride a 59, ride a 59. That extended effective edge will give you more board feel and you'll actually have a little bit more control on a softer, more playful setup. Price point on this, $400. Killing it at $400. For the latest snowboard reviews, check out BoardInsiders.com.